Hey senior golfers everywhere! Do you still enjoy this game as much as we do? I know some of us have lost our A and our B game due to some injuries and of course battling father time. But we still refuse to give up this magnificent game. So we invite you to come and join our journey as we try to split some fairways and perhaps even sink a few putts. But most of all, let's have some fun. We are two farts and a cart. Hi out there senior golfers. My name is Jim. They call me Ratso. I'm from Kaneohe, Hawaii. Today I'm out here with my buddy Dave from Madison, Wisconsin, and we are two farts in a cart. What's on the agenda today, Dave? Well, today we're going to be playing uh, Tucson National, the Sonoran course. Well, this is a neat golf course by the side of the hill where your ball fly high to the sky from that loft it drops so soft on the green it'll put a tear in your eye hi de dee da dee da dum dee da doo da dee dum dee doo hi dee dee day hi de dee da dee da dum dee doo da dee dum dee doo hi dee dee day but if you miss that putt why you'll kick your butt toss your clubs to the bay but I know damn well you'll be right back Playing the very next day. Hi de diddle diddle dum diddle doodle diddle dum. Dilly do ride dilly die day. Hi de diddle diddle dum dilly doodle diddle dum. Dilly do ride dilly die day. Okay, let's see if we can find a fairway. Let's go, seniors. <laughs> okay, guys, guys, we're on the I first tee of Sonoran. It's a really nice course. I like the layout. If you fade the ball or slice it, you're going to end up down there by the pool. So if you fade the ball or do anything else, Kind of aim towards the left. If you hit that cart path, even that, uh, it'll roll down. Feeling of greatness. Here he goes. He's going to be hitting. There you go. Nice hit. Jim. Oh, I'm Feeling so old. of greatness. I cannot see it. Yeah, Was it a good shot? Know. Okay, we got El Chessy over here. El Chessy used to have an A game. Now he's got a B game, but that's still one more game than I had. I never had an A game. I don't know, it's around about uh, PDQ. Oh my goodness, see what happens when you hit a fade? It falls right back in the middle of the fairway. Okay, gang, we're off and running. This is John, he's one of the, the great golfers here at Tucson National. He works here too, so he's got a pretty good course layout. Another one in the middle. Okay gang, here we are. We're on the third hole of the Sonoran Golf Course. I love this hole. You look at the mountains in the background, little elevated tee. Pins in the front today. It's probably playing about 135, I guess. But uh, El Chesh is going to take the tee right now and uh, we two putted the last, well we three putted the first hole, two putted the last hole, but it took us three to get on, so we're bogey bogey. So Dave's gonna sing us a song about why we can't sink a putt. Well here we're playing the par three. That's, if you hit it off to the left, it'll come right back down to you. Cause this is a neat little hole by the side of the hill. From the white tees, plenty, so only 311 yards, but slopes off severely to the right if you slice the ball. If you draw the ball, you're going to end up out there in those mesquite trees. So the best thing to do is try to lay up probably within 100 yards or so. Use a sand wedge or a pitching wedge to get into the green. Pin looks like it's in the back today. Uh, we're not going to film this hole, but uh, we'll tell you the scores later. No, no, this is the number five hole. It's 400 yards. On the right over here, there's a bunch of traps. On the left is out of bounds. So the best shot, right down the middle. Let's see what this old fart can do. I don't know. Dementia, I'm gonna need a T. Oh, he forgot his T. Doesn't even know how to spell T. Well, you don't necessarily do that. I guess it you spell it with just T. Yeah. Get up three times a night, to, just to tee it up. Yeah. <laughs> Feeling the greatness, Mo Norman. Mo Norman, yeah. I pee three nights out of day. Nice. 
Boy, listen to them people. Listen to the crowd. They're roaring. Whoa. Whoa. He is a pro Two years. Nice shot, baby. That was a nice shot. Nice. Hold myself. I'm tired of playing El Chessy's ball. We got to play mine now. God, look at this guy. Good pass that we're kicking. All right. Well, what the hell? I can't see either. It was headed for it. That, that was the Irish butter swing. with my new glasses. Yeah. An Irish butter swing. Yeah. Irish butter. He's the, got Irish butter. The color of money. Of all the times not to have a tracer on my golf ball, that was my best drive of the day. Uh, probably 265. Not bad for a 72-year-old. Yeah, he'll be changing his pants. Yeah. <laughs> There might be some marks on it. Okay, let's see what happens next. Oh, come on. Yay! Yay! Wow. What a setup, huh? Yeah, it took 340 takes. With a line of the putt, did it? Took 340 takes, but he got a par. <laughs> no, that was only one. Taking you on a trip up here where Jimmy Hoffa is really buried. This is number 10 Sonoran. And the, Mr. Nanini, who used to own this property, was a big Italian guy. And this, I'm positive the mob buried Jimmy Hoffa right up here on number 10. Right up on this, this tee box. Nobody even goes up here because nobody can hit the ball from here anyways. So, but Jimmy Hoffa is buried up here. So, if anybody asks you where Jimmy Hoffa is buried, it's right here. Right here on number 10. Right there. If you look at the grass long enough, you can almost see his face in it. So, if anybody asks you, this is where he's buried. Look at that scenery though. Hole number 11, Sonoran course. Par five. It's a really pretty hole. Mountains in the background. We got El Chessy up there now. One half of two, and a, two farts in a cart. Looks good. So easy his swing. So easy. Now if only I could putt. Really? Well I could buy a brand new Lincoln. If all my putts were sinking. If only I could putt. I could buy a ranch with cattle. If in the cup it rattled. If only I could putt. Oh, picture me out on these greens Instead of behind a damn mowing machine Imagine what, if I could putt I could be out on the ocean A appliance suntan lotion If only I could putt I could even play from traps Instead of putting up with crap If only I could putt Oh, picture me out on the green. Straight down the middle, though. <laughs> Instead of behind a damn mowing machine. Imagine what, if I could putt. I could make the putts and holler. I won a million dollars, if only I could putt. I could drive and putt and chip. Instead of taking shit, if only I could putt. Yeah, if you could putt, we wouldn't be behind on every hole. Well, we'd be on, <laughs> be on the tour. <laughs> Thanks a lot. <laughs> if only I could putt. <laughs> oh, that ought to be a good one, Dave. <laughs> well, hopefully, if only you can drive.
there he goes. He's steaming it. Shh, quiet. The crowd goes quiet. It's all around. Smell it. Ooh. <laughs> crowd loves it. Crowd's going nuts. <laughs> oh, if only I could put. Why, oh, I could buy a brand new Lincoln. If all my putts were sinking, if only I could put. Why, I could buy that ranch with cattle. Why, if in the cup it rattled, if only I could put. Oh, picture me out on the greens, instead of behind some damn own machine. Imagine what, if I could put. Why, I could be out on the ocean, why applying suntan lotion. If only I could put. Oh, I could even play from traps instead of taking all this crap. If only I could put. Oh, picture me out on the greens. Oh, instead of behind a damn mowing machine. Why oh, imagine what? If I could put. Why oh, I could make the putts and holler. Why oh, I won a million dollars. If only I could put. I could drive and putt and chip instead of taking shit if only I could putt. Oh, picture me out on the greens. Oh, instead of behind a damn mowing machine. Imagine what. Oh, if I could putt. That's it. I've got to learn how to putt. Well, senior golfers, we played Crook or Tree, we conquered today. Uh, this is how we do it in Tucson, Arizona. We come back to El Chessy's house, get in the pool, have a cold brew. Catch you on the next video. Next video is gonna rock your mind. We're gonna do a tin cup. We're gonna go to two back. We're gonna conquer that 18th hole. And we're gonna show you how the old farts have fun. What do you got to say, Dave? It's right on the money. Because when you get to two back, We'll show you where he hit the seven iron up the car, the driveway path. Don Johnson, who I used to look better than, but now I'm just an old fart in a cart. But you know, you're gonna love it. Until the next time, senior golfers, keep an eye out for us on YouTube. We'll be there soon. All my brothers back in Kanye, love you guys. Big mahalo and aloha to all of you. Till the next time, two farts signing off. And I'll tell you. Hit that ding bell because Jim and I, we got a drinking habit we got to support. Absolutely. So we need the dough. Absolutely. So it's myself and Jim. We're, we're both on Social Security, dudes. Yeah. Got to help us, man. We're Please. unlimited. So. Got to help us. Okay. Big mahalo out there. Goodbye.